welcome to the video about Lagrange interpolating polynomial. We'll be using it to solve this problem. x naught, x1, and x2 are the nodes, so we are asked to find the second Lagrange interpolating formula for f of x, which is 1 over x. I'm going to ask you the polynomial to approximate f of 3. So let's write out this polynomial. The general term of a Lagrange polynomial is given as summation from k equals to 0 to n. f of s k l k of x now the general term so since we are asked to find the second Lagrange polynomial so we'll be having summation k equals to 0 to 2 then this And this is equal to f of x of the zero and zero of x plus now when k is one. which is two so for this our work is to find Our work is to find n subscript 0 of x, n subscript 1 of x, and l subscript this of x. So I'll just undo this since we know that what we have to look for. Now, for us to get l naught, l1, and l2, there's a general formula for it. The general formula says n of n k of x is equal to the double summation from i equals to zero and I not equal to K up to N and then we have this minus xi now this is the general equation for L so now remember for us here we just use the normal k 
So you know this is the number. First to get M not. M not of X. For M not of X, take for it, note that I is not equal to Q. So your your X not your your X one. Yeah, so we have X minus remember here yeah, I need to remember I is not equal to K and our K is zero. So I here will not be K. So what will I be now? I will be one for this part. So we have x1 on the now we know we are going to 2 so still we have x minus x2 now for our down part we have x not now k is 0 minus i now we will not start with remember remember that i is not equal to k since k is 0 so i will be what now 1 x1 and remember k is 0 also so k is 0 minus X so now the simple trick for this is anytime k is a letter for the up one skip that letter start with the one after the letter and then go like that then for the down part write the letter then start with the next letter like that so we could see also for let me scroll this one up. We could see also for, for L1 of X, Y, X minus. Remember, K is 1 for this one, and K is 1. So we'll not do, so what we can not do, we'll not do X1. So we start with x naught. And then move x minus x2. So we are skipping x1. All over. Now we start with x1. Now remember, k is 1. So x1 minus x naught. And then still x one minus x two. So then for so for our L two, which is the last, so we we'll have x minus. Now we we'll skip x two. We start with x naught. x minus x1 all over so we do not do x2 now so since we do not do x2 we start with x2 here now x2 minus x0 and then x2 minus x1 so I've gotten that then we start our from our, our work. So now we know having x minus x1 plus x1 is cool. We found out x1 is 2.5, 2.75. So 
is x to x to is 4 like that and what is x not x not is 2 minus what is x1 x1 is 2.75 and our next one x not is 2 so we we'll do that for everything and we we'll have this as you have seen and then this gives us L0, L1 and L2 remember when you solve for the denominators there you see the fraction up and so I did not turn them to there's no point in stamp I just convert it to fraction so now the next one we have to look for we have to look for f of x naught f of x1 and f of x2 we know that f of x is 1 over x is it not so so we know f of x is 1 over x so let's find f of x naught so f of x naught will be 1 over what is x naught? x naught is 2. 2. So f of x1 will be what? 1 over 2.75. Is that awesome? Yes. And what does that give us? That gives us. 4 by 11 and f of x2 will be 1 over 4 so putting these equations and these equations so let me call this equation star and let me call this equation star star so let's say so equate sub, um, substituting equation star equation star star the, their values in this equation let's call it equation star three star let's call it three star so if you substitute this the values there we will get something like this so this is what we'll be having you can see x l naught of this this is it here and the f of x you can see it here plus l1 of this yeah this is it here plus this the x the f of x1 you can see it here and l2 you can see it here and the f of x2 which is one of them. So one over four. So this to be one over four. One over four. Now I've done that. We multiply. You see, we multiply this and this. We multiply this and this. And this. So so we have this, and then upon multiplying this bracket, then with this. Then multiply this bracket with this, multiply this bracket with this, and then add them up. We are having x squared over 2 minus 35 over 88x plus 44 plus 49 over 45. Over so this is the is the Lagrange interpolating formula. So now, but we are also asked to use this formula to find f of 3 so we have to use this across this polynomial to find f of 3 so using the polynomial so for b to solve for b 
WhatsApp resonates. F of 3, remember F of 3. F of 3 is 1 over 3. So that would be 3 square over 2 minus 35, 88, and 3 plus 49. Adding this uh, approximate answer will give us 0 0.3295 So this is our approximate answer for f of 3 and this is a Lagrange interpolating polynomial. Thank you for this video. See you some other time.